Hey y'all, I'm back with another uh, boosting video. This is, um, you get four medals from this. It's uh, headshots, captive kills, pistol kills. Um, I guess you can also work on spots and, uh, spots and active reloads. Um, you wanna have two controllers or a friend who isn't playing. Um, or you can, you know, switch off your friend. If you want to do, uh, team deathmatch, uh, I mean, you, you can set it up to 35, but I don't think you're gonna get to 35 in the time limit. Um, set the rounds to win to, like, two or three. Um, I mean, it doesn't really matter. You can basically do this on any map, but I'm gonna show you on the easiest one. Uh, no bots. Uh, bleed out time on 15. Friendly fire, uh, doesn't really matter. Uh, weapon respawn after use. Uh, start the match. We got, uh, we're going to change weapon pickups. Everything to Boltock pistol. Um, you can also use long shots, but you don't get captive kills this way. But um, if you just want easier headshots, because it's a guaranteed one shot headshot every time. It's easier to get headshots that way, but you don't get captive kills. Um, you have to switch the second player onto the other team. And the map we're going to play on is Hotel. And um, just it'll work pretty easy. Um, and it's a, um, it takes a minute to set up, but once you get everything set up, it's really, really easy to do. The first two kills, you've got to... Um, I mean, you pretty much gotta use them to set up the last uh, 20 other kills in the match. But, uh, pretty easy. Um, loading times for games are way too long. It should not take this long. Um, let's see. So, I'm going to do, grab a pistol, um, well I guess you don't technically need to use a pistol for this first kill here, uh, I'll show you why in a second, um, but you might as well pick up all the pistol ammo now anyway, um, this is, since he's over here, um, and I don't, you can actually do it over here, but I don't know the, bound the exact boundaries over here, so I'm going to down him, pick him up, and then you, you stay in this, like, right in this spawn until he respawns, um, and he'll respawn on the other side. And so now I'm going to go walk over to the other side. Um, takes a while, but whatever. Um... And then there's going to be a spot, or basically I'm just going to stay in the same spot and headshot um, the drone over and over again. Um, basically, you want to you spot him as much as you can for spots, if you still need spots. Um, and he's going to keep respawning over there, you keep headshotting him, you get captive kills, headshots, spots, active reloads, pistol kills. Etc. Do not. Um, the line you don't want to cross is from that car, the front of that car, to the end of that barricade. And so from here, you can still get a pretty decent shot at the head. Pop his head. You know, reload. Um, he's got six seconds of spawn protection. Uh, that'll give you time for three spots. Um, once you spot him the third time, you're pretty much good to shoot. Um, pretty easy. Just do the same thing over and over again. Um, if he goes down like that, you should try and zoom in and pop his head like that. Um, so yeah, that's it. That's it'll give you pistol kills. It'll give you cap kills with a captive. It'll give you headshots, it'll give you spots, and it'll get you active reloads, um, three spots per kill, and 
an active reload per kill, and then one for everything else. Um, pretty easy, relatively quick, and just really works well consistently. That's it. Thanks, y'all. See you next time. Bye.